Hello guys and welcome back to the channel. In this video, we are going to be talking about the new player that Manchester United wants to sign. His name is John Claire Todibo. He's a French player and he's just 23 years of age. We are also going to be talking about the Sofian Amrabat deal. Why that deal is delayed and how far we've gone with that deal. All this and more we'll be discussing in today's segment of the program. So today we are going to be talking about the new player that Manchester United wants to sign. His name is John Claire Todibo. He's a French footballer that plays for OG Sinis in Le Quan. He's their number one defender, in fact. And guess what? This guy is just 23 years of age. He's so young. Just there as young. I'd be like, one oh, buy Ferdinand at that time. Very young and promising player. I watched this guy highlights. I did research on that guy. That guy is a stopper. That guy. He, and he's very good in passing, you know? Just the way Victor Lindelof did, the way even uh, this guy, Licha, the Sergio Martinez, the way and Sabi flock pass, he's very good with his passes. Go few things that maybe defensive midfield that Sabi flock pass, now in the day. I watched his eye, I did my research on this guy. He has scored three goals so far for Nice, and he has got to one assist. A defender, a 23 year old defender, this guy is also very tall, he's well built, he's six foot two. A defender that is so tall, just be like Vidic. And he's also good with his head. Very good with his head. And you watch this guy highlight, watch his gameplay. He's very fast and pacey too. With that kind of height, he can't be wrong. And now I know this is our coach, get eye. Those places where people need a to look, now they're in eye, they go. If you take time, and in fact, my work, now to tell now about this player. So as I tell you now, I know say you don't hear about a player. John Claire Todibo, French player, playing in the Quan. Nice, nine they play for. Go and check him out. You go know say Eric Ten Hag is a very sensible and smart coach. Now coach will know what he wants and then they go after what he wants. Since Maguire wants to leave the club, um, West Ham wants to sign Maguire. We are looking for a replacement so that in case there's an injury or in case other players they fatigue, we'll get very good defenders. We will step in for us so that they'll feel defend well. Just like Victor Lindelof, we know we have a very good defender in Victor Lindelof. Someone that steps up when he's needed. Whenever Lindelof is called upon, we know saying they deliver. Except maybe one or two scenarios, just like every other player we say sometimes if you know they might but the guy is always delivering for us. So if we sign this to Debo, Maguire go, we have a player who can work on. He's very young. He's just 23 years of age. So he has potential to even improve more as the years go by. So I'm happy we are going after him. He's a good player and if he comes to the team, he will be a nice add-on to the team as well. Will be a very nice add on to the team as well. You know, we've spent a lot of money on Messi Mount, Andre Onana, and also this Hoyland. We've spent about 162 million pounds to get these players. So we need money to recoup. That's why we've not signed Sofian Amrabat. You understand? Before when I before I said this video, I told you we were going to talk about Amrabat. We've talked about the John Claire to the the guy we want to sign, the sharp defender. As the days go by, we'll be talking about them. But before we sign Sofiana Mabat or even this John Claire Todibo, we need money. We've spent a lot of money in bringing in new players. So we are looking forward to selling at least four of our players more or even five as the case may be. West Ham is going for Maguire and Scott McTominay. While um, Galatasaray is going for Fred, Real Sociedad is also going for uh, Donny Van de Beek. So we are looking forward to at least selling Van de Beek and Fred. Fred's, Fred's deal is almost done. It's more like it's about 80, 70% or 80% done. So once he leaves, we can recoup some money in order for us to sign Sophia and Amabat. And to also create space for Amabat in the team. So if we sell, if we sell Fred, Amabat comes in as a replacement for him. We are even going to sell more midfielders. Van de Beek is a midfielder. Scott McTominay is a midfielder. So, bringing in a new midfielder, fresh legs in the team that will step in in place of this player that will at least one is also a, a nice one. Amabrat is a very good defensive midfielder. 
we go supplement Casemiro in case there's any issue with Casemiro in terms of injury or his fatigue or maybe that match if you know they if you don't get the kind of pace you know say players get match where they fit them maybe that match now the team will they play against now team will go need the uh, uh, expertise of Amabat instead of Casemiro so that's why we need Amabat maybe we sell Fred Amavat comes in the deal will push forward with that deal with Fiorentina. Hopefully, he becomes a United player. So that's what I have for you for now. As more news comes up, I'll be here to deliver them to you and make sure that they are verified news. Also, remember, don't forget to subscribe. If you're a Manchester United fan and you've not subscribed, you're dulling. So you need to subscribe and also share these videos so more Manchester United fans will also stay updated as well. Thank you and have a blessed day.